There's two oyster catchers right there. Where? Oh yeah, let's go along the rocks here. We're on Salt Spring Island. It's the 17th of October, and there's some more oyster catchers there. Lots of birds, seabirds here. And that's a woodpecker flying right there. I missed it, but. I think that was a kingfisher. Oh, was it a kingfisher? Sorry, kingfisher. Zoom right in on these, and you can see their bills. Kind of orange. Isn't that cool? And let's go back to these ones here. There's two there on the rocks. Looking for food. And uh, there's a seagull out there too. Right out there. And there's Wendy with the dogs. Beautiful. Let's zoom right in on those babies. Don't scare them. I'm enjoying this. Keep those little mutts away from them. There's three oyster catchers there. Some just took off. There they go. I'm following it. See where he goes. There. Are they flat on the ends or? They look kind of flat. Let's see. Like not as pointed, kind of rounded. Let's check it out. Really close. So do they actually they eat oysters? They I don't know how they all would open them up. I have a tough time opening up an oyster. Sure that's a seal? Oh, Wallace Island. Seagull. Nice day to enjoy the wildlife. I love birds. No, I think it's people talking. They're over in the sailboat there, Wallace Island. So, anyway. It is an absolutely beautiful autumn day on Salt Spring Island, and that is the mighty Pacific Ocean, Trincomalee Channel here. And a uh, nice shoreline. Not a lot of fall color here in this part of the world, in this part of Canada. Pretty much 99% evergreen this island, so. It looks the same year round. You can come out here on a winter day and it don't look any different than a summer day. Except now you maybe have the odd splash of gold or, or yellow from the um, native large leaf maples. Water's pretty calm out there today. Nice out, it's probably about 17, 18 degrees Celsius. There's a Fernwood Dock in the distance, so. Beautiful. <laughs> 